Before we continue, I would like to give the floor to Mr. Manuel Zingeris again because he has two important observations and uh, announcements to make. Well, I started the conference in a non-elegant way, and I'm sorry. I intended to thank two uh, people, two coordinators of the International Commission for the Evaluation of the Crimes of the Nazi and Soviet Occupation Regimes in Lithuania. That is, well, may, maybe it sounds with a touch of corruption, but I still like to thank Mr. Marka Zingeris and my brother and uh, Arvidas Anushauskas, who worked on Nazi and Soviet occupation assessment issues, investigation issues uh, led to subcommissions, and uh, we have issued It may sound boring, but nevertheless, we have had long years of studies that uh, the issues that uh, were discussed in subcommissions and members of this international commission were voting for our decisions. This is one of the issues, persecution of the Lithuanian Jews in summer and autumn 1941, authored by Mr. Sujedelis and uh, Wittmann in German, and uh, Stalin's crimes, discoveries, comparisons of various uh, countries occupied by Soviets have also been included. Another point I would like to make is that we have the person who has made a very big contribution to this work, our ambassador in Israel, who before that worked as a famous Sovietologist who supported our dissident movement in Lithuania. And before 1990, the ambassador, Mr. Romas Misunas, welcome. And the third person, Mr. Vidotas Landsbergis, our colleague uh, Winkelmann is coming tomorrow, if I am not mistaken, whereas Mr. Landsbergis has sent us over the conceptual observations about the possibility of common history in Europe, in common interpretation. And he asked me to inform you that tomorrow he will uh, participate in the afternoon session of our event. Let me thank you again for participating in our conference. Thank you very much again, and now we continue the work of our 